Hi, honey. What's going on? We're going into the museum. What's going on in there today? We're checking out the business expo. A business expo? Yeah. At a motorcycle museum? I know. What could that be about? Well, I think it's pretty cool. I think we got to go check it out. Let's go see. We got to see who's here. Want to give me a tour of the place? Yeah, I'd be happy to give yeah, you I'll a tour. I'll follow you up. <laughs> yeah, I bet you will. <laughs> <laughs> so, how was your day? My day was hectic. How about yeah. yours? Better now that you're here. Oh, I missed you so much. I missed you too. So, let's go Let's go in the museum and see if anybody's in there first. I see our eagle is still watching guard here. Oh, hey, let's sure. go see the motorcycles first. Ooh, I heard there's a bunch of motorcycles up here oh, at this at motorcycle museum. What have we got here? Oh, we got, we got something cooking over here to the right, too. Go ahead. What's this? What's this? Oh, we got this. Is this an electric motorcycle? I Babe, did. where's the engine? It's just got a big battery in it. How cool is that? That is cool. An electric motorcycle. And this is a big ass frog. Hey, hold this. Hey, hold this. Honey, if you have a frog this big, you've got to have a big party. Okay? you got to have a big so party a side, or a big, big fly. <laughs> to, to feed it. And this is a factory Yamaha race bike. Graves Yamaha. Yo, Sylvia's hot dogs over here making some hot dogs. Hey, guys. Hi, how are you? Is that Toto? <laughs> That's Louie. Hi, Toto. <laughs> Click your heels twice. You go home. <laughs> Watch out for the Wicked Witch. <laughs> what have we got here? Some badass Harley Davidsons. Tommy's Harley. FXR with a big twin engine. That thing's nasty. Sporty FXR. A Dyna. And a beautiful road glide. Very nice. In Rockville. In Rockville. You should take a picture of these and send them to Tommy. I'll yes, up you here. should. Do you have your phone in you? Look a picture for Tommy. Before it gets too dark. Here. Go ahead. Oh, oh with the Rockville sign. The, the Rockville sign in the background. How's the hot dogs going today? Good? You guys selling hot dogs? We did better at your other shows. Okay. The Harley riders like hot dogs better than the pencil pushing geeks, huh? Absolutely. <laughs> what do we got here? Some factory Kawasaki's. Like the American flag. Thank you. Kaplan America might cut. Kaplan America might confiscate that and run around with it. Yeah, you gotta watch out for that. That's the new lodging in right there. What's up, guys? How you doing? Hey, hey. How you We're just doing? having about, fun? Um, how beautiful your um, nice the museum is. Thank you. Look Hi, Christy. You look how great. Are you? Look at all these. Here. Look at all these bikes. We got a whole row of bikes here for you. It's a Yamaha XS750, a TY250 trials bike, a Honda 360. Uh, GSXR 1000, 750 Honda. Can you see them? Oh yeah. CX 500 Custom. This is Dane Bunnies from Murder Cycles Twin Star. We got a BS 1400 Intruder. This is a Honda Interceptor. It's a Honda Rebel. It's my 14 year old daughter's bike. Kawasaki Triple, an R6, a Harley Davidson, uh, another Twin Star, an RD 400 Two Stroke. Love it. RD 350 Two Stroke. Um, a Kawasaki Intruder 900, a 350. Look at this one here. Take a close look at this. Can you see this one? This one's beautiful. 350 Honda, uh, two XT500s. This is a, a, an Indian made by Kawasaki called the Indian Drifter. A Kawasaki Duty Trials bike, a 650 Special, a Honda 750, the Yamaha 850, cool little chopper, Honda ATC 70, a Harley Davidson 1200. Honda 500 4 and a Derby 50cc two stroke. You're not going to see this kind of stuff every day. You got to come to the museum. Let's go inside because rumor has it they're having a business expo in there of all things. What's going on, my man? Hey, Carlos. Man, I'm just watching How are you. I'm, just, I'm learning from you, man. I see the way you um, know all these bikes by heart. Man, I am so obsessed with motorcycles. <laughs> my, dad, my dad used to say if you cut my head open, you'd see little motorcycles right, hey, riding around in my head. <laughs> so let me follow this pretty blonde in. Hi, pretty lady. How are you? Are you my arm candy? I am your arm candy. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> That's what your mom said. That wasn't very nice. No. So, American Flag. Yeah? Let's go check it out. Let's go this way. So this is the entrance to Kaplan Cycles. This building was built in 1920. It's the last building that we restored here. We restored the stairs, all the concrete, every square inch of the place. Hey guys, hey. what's happening? You guys having fun? Yeah. This is the main showroom. What's up, Eric? How are you? Keeping an eye on everything for us? 
That's my desk over there. That's Watch, Moses, Eric. He's the brains behind the operation. If your products get shipped on time, you can thank this guy. I don't even know how to ship anything. So, and our bookkeeper sits back there. Kenny usually sits here. And then, uh, wow, look at this. This is our sign-up sheet. All photos. Nice. You took pictures for all, all those people? The all the business. We got some Indians. Indians. Uh, Honda CR500. Awesome. These are my riders over here. This is what I ride. I ride this KTM Adventure 1190. This is Ken Kaplan's, one of his good friends, Bice, but he told me to, to ride it once a month, so I gladly do. This is my FJR 1300. Hey, what's going on, my man? This is a guy, this is Bill Breslau. Bill, say hello. How are you? If it wasn't for Bill, this building would probably be on the ground because for <laughs> how many, how many, how many years did you take care of the building, Bill? Took care of the building for maybe 10 years. 10 years? And still a big fan this building in this complex. Thank you, Bill. This is my girlfriend, Chrissy. Say hello. Hi, nice Bill to Bristol. meet you. How are you? We're doing... Susan, Susan pleased to meet you. We are, we are to see you again. Actually, we've met before probably. We're actually doing a little video for our YouTube channel for our, our friends out in really? YouTube land to show them the business expo. I have my picture Oh, that's awesome. So, Bill and his group donated, I think, $17,000 to the project uh, earlier last year. And, uh, and thank you very much for that. And, 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 and most of all, thank you for putting a new roof on the building, what, 15 years ago? You got that done, didn't you? I promise you that I couldn't have fixed it if you didn't do that because the building would have been on the ground. It, we, there was a lot of structural damage done before you fixed the roof. We love seeing what you've been doing. Oh, thank you. It's thank you. Thank you both. I'm sure it was many days he was working here. He could have, that, uh, <laughs> like Christy, uh, I'm always here, so. I'm sure there's some sacrifice on your part also. But at the end result. It's beautiful. Yeah, hey guys. Did you go in there? I haven't gotten in yet. We're heading in. God bless you, Bill. Thank you. All right. So this is the entrance right here. Oh, I was, I was, this is my FJR 1300. This is a, a, a Springer that I ride. And this is a Dyna. And this is my pride and joy right here. My 1987 Harley Davidson FXR. Those of you who know me well know that my first Harley was an FXR. And I keep going back. Uh, this is from my good friend, Dave, Dr. Dave in California. He owned this bike since it was brand new and uh, he wanted me to have it, so it's here. So. Hello. How are you? Good to see you. How's it going? Hi. This is the bridge. Oh, geez. How come no one turned the lights on on the bridge? There we go. Now no one has to die. There, there you go, a little bit of lights. Hey, what's going on? You guys take, you take, you take, you take it off? Take it off, take it off. Thank you for coming, man. I really appreciate it. God bless you. You take it easy, man. Come down to Craig's kitchen. Absolutely. So this is the bridge. This bridge was built, good, in 1931. And uh, there used to be water power. The water came through right there. So without further ado, Christy, open the door to the sales showroom. Let's see what's in there. Carl Carlos, Carlos, come here, bud. Um, yeah, unlock it. Can, can, can you can you hold this for me? I got They lock they lock this out. Can you, uh, don't hit the button and in, in, in the film. Okay. Can you just film us while we're yep. walking here, please? Gotcha. Carlos. Yes, sir. Carlos, my cameraman. He always uh, takes care of things when Kenny drops the ball, which is most of the time. Shoot him under the bus. Let's close this. Coming in. So this is this is the business expo here. Hello, how are you? These are the ladies who make, the ladies who make it possible for us to wire transfer all the money to you and uh, get your wire transfers. That's right. You and Nicole, how are you? Have you met my girlfriend? And my daughters? And my daughters? Yes, we just met. And Jordan. Hi. Nice to meet you. Thank you. Look how beautiful she is. Stop. My supermodel so daughter. So if you're wondering, a lot of us. A lot of us didn't know that he owned another shirt besides Captain Yeah. Well, just so you guys know, you always see me in a black tank top, right? So, for the last five years, or a black tank top or a black t-shirt says Captain Cycles. I put on a white t-shirt the other day, and the kids were like, what are you all dressed up for, Dad? This is a plain white t-shirt. I, I, I have so, tailors. <laughs> I did bring my black whistle, so don't make me blow the whistle, because I will. Thanks for taking care of me. Thanks. Thanks, Chris. Appreciate it. So, <laughs> Bell in the living room with my house. So, we have Max here, we have a so, 
Did anybody go down? Did anybody tell the people there's a museum open down there? Oh, yeah. 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 Thanks for coming, 
bud? Oh, it's good. Good to see you. Great day. This is Carl. He's one of our volunteers that helped me clean up Rockville. Yes. For several years, he we went out, cleaned up graffiti, and he'd show up with his own truck. we whack our chainsaws and yep, everything. everything. So, either way. <laughs> So thank you, Carl. Oh, you're all God bless you. It's been a pleasure, my man. Have you met my girlfriend, Christy? No, I haven't. Nice to meet you. So, yeah, we, we, she went over your house with me uh, for Fourth of July. Oh, it's too bad. But <laughs> so, yeah, so we had a big time up there. On, on, uh, you know, what? Just with the fireworks and everything. Because I got her. Oh yeah, so we're doing a YouTube video and Nick Brown's did all the vendors. Hey, thank you, Ken. So, oh, this is perfect. OCD. <laughs> we put all the green and blue. We have Jimi Hendrix over here. There we go. And all these holidays inside the building is because the, the ceiling's green on this side. Yes. Yeah. Hello, ladies. How are you? Hi. Good to see you. How are you doing? Good to see you. Hi. Nice to meet you. Okay. Did you guys have this rock roll patch? Yeah. 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 Hello. <laughs> Thank you for coming, guys. Thanks for coming. Did you get downstairs to see the museum yet? No, not yet. Great, how's it going? Good. 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 Did you get downstairs to see the museum yet? Yes, I am. Oh, I, awesome. want to go, I, I want to be able to spend a little bit more time. So. Yeah, absolutely. Whenever you're here, we're here every day, so I'd like to come back. Thank you for coming. Did you, get, did you get that upstairs to see the, the museum of the motorcycle? Not yet. Oh, my God. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Hey, guys. How are you doing? Good to see you. Before you go, make sure you get downstairs to see the motorcycle. Yeah, you heard. Because I haven't seen it. You like this one. Downstairs is awesome. So, uh, a lot of hot There are a lot of hot dogs there, yeah. You heard it? Oh, yeah. Well, more hot dogs than anyone else. Got uh, tuned up by Sam from Flint's Barbershop or nice. West, West Main Barbershop. what's going on, my man? How you doing, man? This guy might be joining the team to oh, help us conquer the uh, purchasing <laughs> motorcycles. Find all the challenge. Details. Bring them all back to life. All so, those bikes. Yeah, we got to talk. Perfect. So, yeah. awesome. yeah. Let's go downstairs and check out the museum. Do it. Yeah. We, we already went down this. Let's go this way. Hey, babe, don't follow us. Hey, she's walking. Let's go check out the museum. 
Nice and toasty, warm. Heaters are cranking. So, we've got our rope pass on the other side there. Kawasaki's, KTM's, Suzuki's, um, Triumphs over here. We've got a little bit of everything. So, uh, this is a Vertimati. I bet you, when's the last time you've seen one of these? A Vertimati uh, supermoto bike? My guess is never. <laughs> It's a really rare piece of 605. This is owned by Pete Baccarosa, the Baccarosa Insurance Agency. Pete's one of our benefactors. He owns Superbike Universe. Awesome dude. Um, he, owns, he owns a lot of these super bikes you see in here today. So, we got our BSA collection over here. BSA 250 motocross bike. We got a 500. We got a 650 Thunderbolt, a 650 Lightning. And uh, check out this Royal Star right here. I think it's a 53. This is really awesome. I mean, excuse me, golden flash. Look at this golden flash. Look at the colors on that thing. Isn't that beautiful? Check this one out. Look at this one. Look at this one. You want the really good. Really, look at your blonde hair in there, that green. Look how it pops. <laughs> wow, that's a nice, that's a nice that, color. Does that work beautiful with your blue eyes? Blonde hair? Uh, it's perfect. <laughs> yeah, it's red and white. That's a nice uh, color on you, Christy. It is. You got a stoplight, just in case. Hey guys, hi. How are you? Good, thanks for coming. Thank you. This is an old Indian 42 Chief sidecar. Absolutely. When's the last time you saw a pink and white 1949 Honda? Never. Probably never, right? Good to see you. How's it going? Good. Okay. Oh, yeah, that's right. Uh, oh, yeah. Yeah, Christy and I rented uh, the same, something very similar, a 30 foot uh, four winds in uh, Florida. Uh, two weekends ago yeah. for uh, Bike Over Fest. It was Fest. awesome. We had a good time. Yeah, we had such a great time. Yeah, right so you're the one? Right oh. I said, yeah. Oh, that's we should awesome. definitely want to check it out. Yeah, so we definitely will. let us know. Okay, awesome. I'll we'll stay in touch with you. Yeah. Okay, sorry. Excellent. Sounds oh, good. I'm heading to Maine tomorrow morning to buy 50 bikes or so from my guy who's Thursday. building. Oh, yeah, tomorrow we're moving in with you and your house. And <laughs> Thursday I'm going to Maine to buy a bunch of motorcycles. But I'll be, I'll be back for sure. This is your first time through here? It is, unfortunately. I hate to say yes, but yeah. Well, right down the road. You can see the business expo over there. Yeah, we stopped at there Okay. Yeah. We have a couple of clients as well. Excellent, excellent. Downstairs, we're putting a restaurant, bar, and microbrewery. Did you see the plants? They're right, right over here. Did you see them? We were actually um, we're taking a. Uh, everybody has a little Hey, Carlos. No motorcycle museum is complete until you get your Viking head. Thanks to Arch from uh, the last event we had here. Nice. He donated the, nice. our Viking head to us. Beautiful. Isn't that cool? Beautiful. <laughs> so this is these. This is our uh, plans for the restaurant bar and microbrewery on the first floor. On the far end, which is down there, directly underneath, on the first floor, this is going to be the kitchen with a, a breakfast bar. And these are all the, the tables and uh, um, what do you call them, uh, booths. And then over here, this is going to be the tanker and school bus bar. The, the um, school bus bar is this right here. We're taking an actual school bus and uh, cutting the side of it out and turning it into a bar. They have one at the Iron Heart Horse Saloon. We saw that bike week. That was awesome. And then uh, this is going to be the tanker. We're going to take the tanker and cut it in half and buff it out. And um, it's going to be called the um, Thunderdome Cafe. It's being designed by Turtle Transit and James Riseborough. So 
Um, that's his pain. We're going to have them kind of connected. It'll be like a, some type of extension of the bar. And the difference, these are just prototype photos. We're going to have actual motorcycles planted in the side. We'll take the front, like, picture of that Indian with the front end taken off of it. And, and it mounted right into the, the side of the yeah, just sitting on a bike and going to your drink. So that's a plan. And then the microbrewery is going to be on this side. And there's a bump out in the front. So it'll be essentially the size of this, but bigger because it'll be a, a front and a back. So it's going to be pretty well. That's the plan. And here's our schedule of events if you haven't seen this yet. Carlos, can you put this on the screen? Or if I put it on there? This is a 2019 schedule of months. We're going to do bike nights every Friday night and Saturday nights. We're going to do. We're going to have the world's first drive-in movie theater for motorcycles only behind the building here, which will be really cool. So you can ride up on your bike. Um, if you have a, uh, if you have an, our own FM station, so if you have a dresser, you can tune in with it. Now we'll have a, a speaker system. But we're doing a motorcycle auction here on May 25th, and then uh, our biggest event. Uh, of the, the to date, the biggest one we've ever had will be May 31st, June 1st, and June 2nd. We've got we're calling it Rock Stock. We got 21 bands. Uh, we just signed up ACDC uh, a tribute a tribute band called Back in Black. They're they're, uh, they're coming, and uh, Doug Danger signed up to do a jump here on June 1st. So we're gonna have motorcycle jump. We're gonna have uh, mini bike racing, mini trike racing, uh, Harley Davidson stunt shows. We're gonna have Doug Danger doing a jump. Um, we don't have. Uh, little people jumping off a Ferris wheel yet, but we're trying to line that up. So, <laughs> just kidding. Uh, the um, Friday, Saturday, Sunday is going to be the, the Thunderdome Cafe event, okay. and then we're having a Freedom Ride in July. And then we're, we're doing these are all three day events. Murder Cycles Local Motorcycle Club is doing a Cafe Fever event here again. That'll be a three day event. Uh, then we're doing another Back to Old School Rock, which will be a rock and roll event. Another auction. Then we do Rocktober. And then we're doing a haunted museum next October. So we've got six three-day events planned for the whole year. And then Friday night, like nights and Saturday night we'll get So we're going to really be kicking things off. This will be a deep place to be if you're riding a motorcycle. Or if you like motorcycles or you like rock and roll, this is going to be a really kick-butt spot for sure. It'll be one of the kind. People are going to come from all over the place. You know? So pretty excited about it. What do you think about that, honey? I think it's awesome. That is pretty is that the first, first? Is it the first you've heard of uh, heard of any of these things? Probably. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, we got lots of plans. Lots of plans. So we'll definitely be in touch. Um, I I will talk to you when I get back to me, and I want to see the rig. Absolutely. Yeah. Maybe we'll be driving that to Florida. There we go. <laughs> nice uh, thank you. Thanks. Good talking to you. Take care. These are the uh, flags that we had. Christy uh, got this hooked us up with these, right, honey? Oh yeah. Some, right? Take a flag. Oh, yes. <laughs> Pick up the face out here. Pick up the face. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. I can't. So. Are we getting dinner out of this or what? Maybe. Yeah, we've been selling a lot of tickets. Sure. Hey, we show me the 30 second girl. Oh, she's taking over. Take there you go. He has a case the case of the hips. There you go. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Run. <laughs> So we got all the flags, the checkered flag, green flag, white flag. We're an Antique Motorcycle Club of America ambassador site. I am an AMC ambassador myself, but the site is also, to be an ambassador site, you got to have camping. So we have a 52-acre campground that we actually live at, or our, we call it the Kaplan Compound. It has two motocross tracks, a lighted track, and a uh, natural train three-quarter mile track. So we used to have a motocross uh, camp there, a training camp, but everybody got hurt and old and tired like me. So we just use it as a playground. As if there's a pond with three diving boards and, and a rock jumping tower. So we're going to have events next summer where the, the AMCA guys are going to come up from all over the country and camp out there. And uh, we're going to have a big party. I have a frog. I have a 5,000-pound frog all the way from Ghana. So with a frog that big, you've got to have a big party. Watch would say. These are all the championships I won. I don't know if you guys know. I used to race motocross. I've won 16 New England championships. Um, I, this is my, my my favorite one. This is the NESC championship. I was telling my daughter, take. She was getting frustrated about her her trials and tribulations trying to get into the motorcycle industry. And uh, I told her I'd quit six times. So I broke many bones. And each time I did, I quit. And I kept on coming back. And I finally won my first championship uh, in the 25 plus class. NEMA and then the 40 plus, then the 450A class champion. These are all expert class championships. This is a 450 expert, 450 expert, that's a 450 class champion, 25 plus. This is a Supercross championship, the New England Supercross uh, indoor series. Um, 
2006, 2007, I used to dominate the uh, vet classes in the indoor supercross. But this is my favorite one, the NESU, and I got to ride with the Jack KTM King and all the other fast vet riders in New England, and that was a lot of fun. Um, then Can't, I broke my back in 2017, that slowed me down a little bit. Okay, cool question. What, what was that mountain that you raced up? That mountain that you raced up a mountain? Oh, Mount, Mount, Mount Greylock. I, I did, I did uh, um, my first and only ever um, outdoor hair scramble race or J Day race. It's, uh, it's a two hour race through the woods. It was in 1990. I was 25 years old, and I showed up on a YZ490, and I was an expert in a pro motocrosser at the time. And I'd never raced off road, so I signed up for the B class. And everyone's like, Oh, you're a sandbagger, you're a sandbagger, you got to sign up for the A class. So I went back up to sign up because everybody was busting my chops, and I signed up for the A class. And it's about halfway through the race, I had no idea what position I was in because it was like mayhem. Everybody's crashing everywhere, and I'm stuck in the mud, and you know, I'm crashing. And I just kept, I remember saying serenity prayer over and over and over. You know, God grant me the serenity, you know, the serenity prayer to keep. Just keep charging, and I came on the finish line. And like you won, and I was like, I won. <laughs> so I didn't even know it was a two-hour yeah, race. Yeah. But that was my first and nice. and, uh, and, and uh, my first try at, a, at an off-road uh, race. So that, that went quite well. Nice, so, Dane. What do you think? What do you think of the business? I was just showing off my bike. <laughs> pretty. Uh, it was uh, it was pretty awesome actually. I'm, it was cool to be a part of the museum. Not only because I'm a part of it with you, but to have my business here as a whole yeah. changes things and. I posted on Facebook. I'm like, I got to bend my business and see all my motorcycles at the same time. How can you beat that? <laughs> <laughs> and go pick out your new one. And go pick out another motorcycle. Yeah, while there you go. Like, if you guys saw the video of, of the of all the Suzuki trail bikes that, that I that I just picked up, like 13 of them. Dane calls him and goes, Ken, that's the bike I had when I was 16 first years bike old. Ever. First he was bike ever. he was like still living, and he's like. Answering his phone, I'm like, "Don't sell the bike." Yeah, we're still <laughs> loading them up, you know. <laughs> and uh, he called me, so I was like, "No problem." So he's gonna go pick out, pick it out, make sure it's the one he wants. Absolutely. But anyways, he's getting now. This is one of his bikes right here. He owns a bunch of really awesome bikes. This is a frame off custom that he built. Um, really cool story. The lady who uh, originally owned this bike, brand new, came to the first show that he put it in, and uh, we did a video with her uh, seeing the bike for the first time, swinging a leg over it. So that was a really cool story. Frame up, frame up restoration. Um, so he also owns a CM two hundred T, which is like a museum quality piece. It's on display in the museum, very low miles that he bought in California, and some real nice Harleys. But um, he doesn't discriminate. He writes Hondas and Harleys. That's right. <laughs> and now maybe Suzuki will be back in the back, back, back in the family. family. I mean, it's just gonna end up sitting here in the museum anyways with the rest of them. But at least I'll own it. We'll, we'll pop it up right here for you. Yeah, and then I'll, when I want to ride it at your place, yeah. I'll bust it out right. So, so Kenny, okay. uh, how was the event today? It was spectacular. No, it was a great turnout. Let me tell you that. It was awesome. Oh, yeah, and uh, I was so strong, I literally destroyed the scissors. Nice. Awesome. Great. <laughs> Didn't hear about that from the mayor. <laughs> Who was here for the ribbon cutting? Mayor Sandy Mary Daniels here? Yeah, um, Mike Winkler, uh, Tim Acker. Awesome. Dan, awesome. Mark. Let's go in the lobby and see what the girls are up to. Cool, I'll see you after. All right, continue. Thank you, Dan. So this is the lobby. It's the entry to the museum right here. And we've got some cookies. What kind of cookies do you got here? Uh, oh, these are gluten-free, great. <laughs> <laughs> They're very good. Mm. So, well, thanks, everybody, for tuning in. That's about the end of the road for us here. Thank you for watching. And uh, we look forward to seeing everybody in YouTube land again. So peace <laughs> out from Capital America. God can't, bless America. Careful, Governor.